U.S. warns Iran over Persian Gulf. The United States is ready to send additional forces and means to the Persian Gulf zone again in the event of an escalation of tensions with Iran and the identification of alleged threats from its side to shipping in the region, the commander of the Central Command Air Force USA, Lieutenant General Alexis Grinkowicz, said at a meeting with the Washington Group of Military Observers. But we are trying to send the following signal. We have increased our forces in response to a specific threat. This demonstrates the importance of the region for the United States. If Iran decides in connection with the withdrawal of reinforcements that it has a favorable opportunity, then the United States is absolutely ready to return and build up forces again. I hope they have caught the signal and will be restrained for a long time, the military commander said. According to him, the recent transfer of American reinforcements, including fifth-generation F-35 fighter bombers to the Persian Gulf zone, had a good impact on Tehran's allegedly destructive intentions. The increased presence of surface vessels that went in combined with our air power has deterred Iran from taking any actions against maritime shipping, Grinkowicz told. It has had good effects. He added, U.S. Defense Secretary Lloyd Austin ordered the additional U.S. capabilities to the region after Iran attempted to seize two commercial tankers in international waters off the coast of Oman in early July, which followed Iran's successful seizure of two oil tankers transiting the Strait of Hormuz just months earlier. The U.S. Navy says, in all, Iran has seized or harassed almost 20 ships in the region over the past two years.